This is Excel with Emmy. On this channel, we talk about career, education, lifestyle. If these are subjects that are of interest to you, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notification for this channel. Um, are you going to spend 160 on a bag? Do you think it was extravagant or do you think you are too cheap? You know, girl, level up. Let me know what you think. <laughs> yeah, let me know what you think in the comment section. Welcome to the channel where education meets adventure and passions are transformed into life of the Excel with Emmy. Today is a sunny day and it's payday. After doing my whole budget, I only spread myself for my birthday. I never got anything for myself. So I'm going to the mall and i try to level up a little bit mm -mm, mm -mm. i'm wearing some brown heels as well and then i'll pair it with this bag yep <laughs> yep so i'm going to the mall to get myself something maybe a window shop maybe i'll buy something nothing out of my budget and That'll be it. I get there, you'll buy. And oh, I nearly forgot this glasses. It's part of the outfit, yeah. I'm feeling myself. <laughs> yeah, so like I said, let me take you along on a little shopping adventure. As you can see, I'm cheating myself on my first designer bag. I'm going to buy a coach bag yeah but as exciting as it sounds i want to use this moment to talk about something really important budgeting and living within our means i'm at the mall it's called the seattle premium outlet so premium or nothing tending to be rich so we'll be entering these stores and to see if we can buy some in the future <laughs> Yeah, so join the cruise with me whilst I enter some of these shops. So let's continue what I was saying. Let's talk about living within our means. First, I'll start with a budget. Whether it's for a better, a big purchase like this or a day-to-day -day expenses, having a clear plan actually helps me manage wisely. Like you have to set aside certain amounts, each for savings, necessities, and yes, even for luxuries like this one. Um, I think that living on budget doesn't mean depriving yourself. It just means that being mindful about where your money goes, right? Keep track of all the expenses, make adjustments when needed. This way, you know you are living within your means and not overspending. Like I said, today is payday. I just, in Google Notes, open all the, uh, write down all the expenses for the month. And then I know that, oh, I'm left to $200 that I can spread myself with. And I'm trying to be mindful of my spending in such a way that every month I don't buy something more, uh, something more than $200 for myself. So I, I know that I like clothes, I like dresses, but this is actually really helping me once i hit that 200 like it's a deal breaker i'm not going over it and it's been very helpful so if you want to adopt that i think that will be helpful to you as well and also let's be low end living let's talk about low end living it can be stylish and satisfying low end living doesn't mean that you have to look trashy like bro you don't have to look trashy Look for quality items that fit your budget and brings you joy. Like I first, like I'm shopping at Aldo for the first, like Aldo is not like, um, it's not designer, it's designer. It's on the low end, I would say. So like, you don't have to break the bank to look this good. That song was meant for us. <laughs> but yeah, some of the ways to live like on the low end is shopping sales, using discount codes, buying second hand raise up your hands if you are not a fan of second hand let's see how you do it let's see how you survive man yeah so buying second hand stuff um is a great way to um, manage your spending or buy stuffs without overspending so these all those stills or things i'm looking at right now were on sales and they were on discount so some of them were like 9.99 15 dollars but i ended up buying nothing 
uh, like a shoe or something because I, di I didn't need a shoe. Um, I went there to buy the coach bag, but I got some jewelry from Aldo. So, so I'm sure someone is like, you are talking about living within your means and you're buying a coach bag. But yeah, remember that budgeting and living within your means isn't about restricting yourself. It's just about the freedom that you have, freedom to enjoy um, the little things that you can afford or the little pleasures, um, like a beautiful bag without the stress of a financial drain, right? <laughs> Oh, it's not it's not bad like I thought. It really isn't bad like I thought. The size of the bag is going to determine the price because the smaller ones are even expensive now. Oh. So this part of our one is excluded from promotion, but it caught my eye. <laughs> yeah, so apparently they are running a promotion. That's why, uh, yeah. So this is a bag and I wanted to see the price of this bag, $730. Um, but... <laughs> I don't go anywhere that will use these big bags. This is what I ended up buying. Do you need a shopping bag for instance? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
when I was trying to check out, uh, you you get one year warranty. If it's your birthday, they gave me ten percent of extra ten percent. It was a promotional sale, but they still gave me another ten percent off, and you get warranty. But right, I ask so I can bring that back anytime. Like something happens, which is like quality wise they never they know you're not going to bring back the bags so like yeah but it was a nice experience yeah so um on my way back i told you guys i was not spending over budget i got a coach bag which was let's say 160 dollars being transparent and then i got the earrings from aldo which was like 40 dollars so as planned i spent 200 dollars for my birthday yep um I'll be going back. I wanted to tour the stores, like just window shop, but it's getting late and most of them are closing. We entered Michael Kors and they said the store is about to close in two minutes. So I don't want to enter any store and they'll be like they are closing in about. So I'll just go home. The more you go into the stores, the more you are tempted to buy some stuff, you know. So if I don't take the camera again, this is Excel with Emmy on this channel. We talk about career, education, lifestyle. If these are subjects that are of interest to you, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notification for this channel. Bye.